Hi viewers, now this video isn't about the non-silver fakes that I'm sure that will be flooding the market before very long and I'm certain the counterfeiters are already working away on the dies uh, may even possibly have churned out some coins already No, this is an information video about the silver Kruger and commemorative medallions that were struck back in the 80s uh, as you can see there, they were actually struck in uh, three nines fine silver, weighing just over 22 grams. And they were struck by Private Mint, and this particular one has been in my collection for many years, but uh, I've only shared it privately up until now, uh, basically because of the controversy surrounding them. Um, obviously the mint that struck them, uh, I've never managed to identify who, who did them and uh, obviously had they been identified they probably would have been sued because they were in breach of the uh, trademark from uh, the South African Mint. Anyway, um, I've noticed that these are now fetching quite a premium, you know, just over 22 grams of fine silver and um, with the metal rotation rather than the coin rotation and this particular one I believe was the first year of issue 1982 to commemorate 15 years of the gold Krugerrand and I, I seem to remember at the time there was a lot of a lot of hype over this a lot of hoo-ha about the South African Mint not being too happy about these being struck but um, I couldn't I, you know, that data has uh, disappeared that I found uh, many years ago <laughs> But anyway, um, I've never tried this one. Actually, I don't think it's ever been out of the capsule, actually. So we'll uh, give it a quick try on my coin slide. I'm sure it is, of course, absolutely fine. Yeah, nice and slow down there. Three nines, fine. Jolly good. <laughs> Um, they did actually have the milled edge, if anyone was wondering. There you go, there's the milled edge. And obviously they are really classified as a bullion round or medallion because obviously they don't have a face value. Yeah, I kind of wish I'd picked up a whole roll of them back in the day. I see they're fetching over 40 US dollars each now. <laughs> but anyway, I didn't. I only got that one. So, uh, but anyway, I thought I'd put a bit of interesting and useful information out there for the silver community. So, thanks for watching.